So while Maguro Port got today, after 27 years of operation, Jungle Safari is closed at Dejure Summerland for a new 2021 attraction. <laughs> Hello there guys, my name is Coach Chad Dogster, Ball, Ball Built for Theme Park News and this is the Theme Park News update from Digio Summerland. Now before we get started we've got 9 shout outs to give to you, so big shout outs go to Brian Galeas, Falco Flair, FS Marcus, Lucas Starkiller, Harry and Snyder, Julian Hudson, Sam Lovett, The Mikey G Show and Coaster Globe. Now if you want to shout out in tomorrow's video, comment down below any of the videos we upload today or just comment down below your shout out anyway. So that's how we're going to do the shout out, so it means we've got more people to shout out, so more comments means more shout outs. Now of course, make sure you go check out our videos over the past few days, we've got plenty of news updates that we've uploaded over the past few days, we've got plenty of news updates to come over this weekend and this week, as well as other videos as well, so stay tuned for all of that. Uh, just a few examples from uh, yesterday, uh, you got the Dream World Australia news update and Knott's Berry Farm, those are the two videos we released yesterday and that's where the comments came in from uh, for the shout outs on today. Um, obviously Dream World Australia, we covered about Tower of Terror 2 that's closing um, and the coast of being retired and of course Knott's Berry Farm with the Triotech joint announcement on November 19th during the IAPA trade show in Orlando, Florida. We've also got plenty of news updates that's been uploaded over the past few days. Uh, we've got plenty of updates there. We've still got four maze walkthroughs that need a lot more views, so make sure you go and check them out. Uh, and there we go. So let's have a look at the theme park news from update from Digio Summer. We've got plenty of news updates to come over today and tomorrow and during the week as well. So this is Digio Summerland, and basically this is on uh, their... Uh, brand new 2021 attraction. Now to make way for this, they're having to close Jungle Safari. Now Jungle Safari was a family boat ride uh, that first opened in the park in 1993. And during the 2020 season, the ride will be demolished uh, and construction will go underway for the new 2021 attraction. We do have a statement officially from the park's website and the statement from the Dure Summerland uh, reads, uh, as follows, so the Jersey Summerland states on their website about Jungle Safari After 27 seasons, Jungle Safari closes after last opening day on Sunday, October 20th, 2019 So it's already closed Since 1993, King Kong has been gardening his large cave in the Jungle Safari And roared by more than 10 million guests who have taken the yellow banana boat ride past the jungle small and large animals Jungle Safari must make room for the whole family to get something new, big and much, much better for the whole family instead on, off from the tw tw season 2021. Follow us uh, on social media where we can look forward to telling you about the huge new project, the new huge project. Um, so this definitely sounds like a very, very, very exciting family project. It sounds like it's going to be a big attraction. And you can tell it's a big attraction already because, of course, they're having to close Jungle Safari, um, you know, the season before to, to allow construction for this project. So I'm expecting a really big project. Now, I think with, um, like, this rapids ride next to it, I'm thinking that this will not be something like Mystic River Falls. It won't be something like that which is opening next year at Silver Dollar City. Make sure you go check out uh, all the videos that we did on that. It was a very big project to follow. Uh, we followed the teaser trailer, we followed the announcement, we followed the construction, the closure of the original Rapids around. We followed a lot on that project. So make sure you go check out all the videos for Mystic River Falls at Silver Dollar City. So yeah, I don't think it's going to be one of them. I'd be a bit surprised if it is. Uh, but there we go. If you want two rapid rides, you can have a family one. Then you can have a throw one with a massive drop. Uh, so they could take that route. Uh, they say it's going to be fun for the whole family. And technically, Mystic River Falls is still a, fam a full family attraction. As well as all those swilling elements like the massive waterfall type drop. Um, so it's going to be interesting to follow. Um, there is a possibility that they'll keep the original ride system. Now, we don't know exactly if they're continuing to keep the ride system or if the ride system is going to be demolished. I think 2020, throughout the 2020 season, that is our best guess to tell if they're going to remove the entire uh, ride system or if they're just going to uh, 
sort of take bits out like theming, uh, maybe the jungle safari theme's going to go and it's going to be bringing in a brand new theme with some new scenes and some new elements, make it a full water dark ride maybe. Um, it's hard to tell at this point because so all we know so far is this jungle safari is closing and we've got this big new fam all f fun for the whole family attraction for 2021. So again, it's just very interesting to see uh, and sort of you know, hear about what could happen. Um, with with this new attraction so um i think this is going to be a very good project to follow i think this will be uh, i think this definitely will be part of the 2021 european attractions new attractions analysis in two years time we do that video um along with the likes of the grona lund coaster the world of belgium coaster loads of stuff from europe pop de pan's new coaster from mac from matt rides the actually spinner um, so this will join the list of new attractions for 2021 and, and analysing them in more detail. So I am excited to see what's going to happen all with that one. Um, so there we go, so we haven't got much details apart from that really. Uh, we don't know, if, like I said, we don't know if they're going to keep the ride system, whether it's going to be a big re with some new scenes added, some new elements to the ride, a couple of retracks here and there, or they're going to rip out the whole ride system entirely and bring in a brand new dark ride, or a brand new ride experience of any, of any kind. Um, I'd like to think it's a new water ride, just so they can keep the, uh, um, so they're replacing a water ride with a water ride, basically. Uh, I would like it to be that. Um, but like I said, we don't know at this point uh, what it's going to be. So uh, it should be pretty interesting uh, to see what's going to happen with this. So thank you very much for watching this theme park news update on the Jersey Summerland. Uh, make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Comment your thoughts and your shoutouts down below to get shoutouts for both reasons. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more updates and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube channel. Make sure you share the channel as well. Click that share button and share the channel all around with your friends and family. Let's get this channel up and running again. Um, let's get this channel growing ever, ever slowly and ever rapidly. Because uh, this channel's been growing ever since we started. So uh, let's keep that growth thought. Let's keep it going. Uh, and let's get... To, let's, I, I tell you what, I'm going to give you guys a goal. I'm going to give you guys uh, a long-term goal. Let's try and get, and now this is probably a long shot, but let's try and get to 2,000 subscribers before the end of the year. We've got a few, we've got, got a couple, couple months to do it. You've got the rest of this month, November and December to do it. So um, not a long a period of time, but still a good period of time. So make, let's try and get to 2,000 subs before the end of the month. So thank you very much. My name is Coach Chow, Kill in the Coast of Life, and I'll see you guys for another theme park news update very, very soon. Take care. Have an awesome day, my friends. Thank you.